Oh gosh. All right. So people are saying Shiba Inu is dead. I'm dead. <laughs> Thinking about that. Shiba Inu is not dead. What, what has gotten into people? People think just because we have some consolidation, Shiba Inu, they're focusing more on leash and bone. That's absolutely ridiculous. And I'm going to tell you why in this video. Before we jump into it, though, go ahead and hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you like more content on Shiba Inu, other altcoins, DeFi, blue chips, crypto regulation, we got you covered. Everything covered here on the channel that relates to the cryptocurrency markets. So with that being said, I want to bounce in here and ask you a question. If Shiba Inu were dead, would the third largest wallet on Ethereum be piling in 86 billion SHIB? Ask yourself that question. This was three hours ago. The third largest whale on Ethereum's blockchain purchased 86 billion SHIB tokens, despite the anemic price performance on, on the meme coin. The transaction is valued at 2.3 million. So why the hell would this guy buy $2.3 million worth of SHIB if SHIB were dead? Riddle me this. It's not dead. Uh, it's in a accumulation phase. This is exactly where you want to buy a cryptocurrency. Look at this, uh, especially down way down in here. We've been talking about this level for a while. Get down to this 2-1 level. Oh, yeah. Give me some of that. It hit down here back in January and February, too. Looking back on it, should have been accumulating a lot more down in here. Okay, I wasn't. But looking back on it, we had another chance to do so when it bounced back down here and started bouncing off at the 2 one two, two. Uh, That level still remains. But right now, we're trading sideways at the 2-6. Overall, when we zoom out, yeah, we're still well off all-time highs. We're about a 4x away. But I think this is a great opportunity to be accumulating like this guy's doing, right? The wallet, which currently holds, get this, $3.5 in various digital assets. Yeah, $3.5 billion. Made a large purchase while SHIB was struggling to break out from the March 2 resistance. Uh, fortunately, unfortunately rather, the purchase did not help SHIB's price. Well, yeah, because we've got a market cap that is absolutely enormous now of $14.6 billion. Uh, we've got $83 million in daily volume happening right now. So, yeah, it's not going to move the needle as much. But from a standpoint of looking at Shiba Inu objectively, if this guy over here with billions of dollars in his wallet is buying this particular asset, that should tell you something. It shouldn't make your decision for you, but it should certainly tell you that Shiba Inu is not dead, right? So with that being said, uh, these whales over the last month have been accumulating, okay? Uh, the highest price point that we've seen in the last month or so was that 2.9 level, uh, which is considered a strong psychological resistance level to get back into the threes as the token has already failed to break through it uh, in the beginning of the month. Okay. Uh, we're looking at, you know, an overall market that is slowly creeping back, right? It's slowly coming back into fold. And I do think when we get into the heat of another bull market, Shiba Inu will be at the forefront of the discussion again. And now that it's a household name, now that it's ranked number 15 overall by market cap, it will be a household name that people feel uh, better putting their money into and having less risk associated with that investment. At least that's where I sit. Uh, so will the gains be massive like they once were with Shiba Inu where people were thousand Xing? Probably not. But in terms of being a great blue chip play with big upside, I think that's where Shiba Inu sits right now. So no, uh, in my opinion, Shiba Inu is not dead. Okay. Nowhere near being dead in my opinion. Let me know you think uh, what you think about it, though. Down below, uh, drop your comments. Always love hearing from you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you all so much for stopping in, and uh, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.